then it's gonna get wet. Oh, you better bring snow pants. Awesome. Got that? Do you want? Do you want cheese or no? No cheese, please. Anna is prepping lunch for tomorrow. Austin's prepping the pineapple. That one's not pink, not as exciting. It's gonna be better though. Yeah, it probably will taste a little better. Sandwich is ready. Honey mustard. This is the Austin way of cutting pineapple. He has mastered this art. In case you didn't catch it last week. Or the week before, or the week before. It's just a weekly thing. Austin is starting to pack. I'm bringing not all of this because <laughs> I have been here for a week. I'm just bringing this backpack and I'm feeling really proud of my light packing actually. That's not so. all you're bringing. Oh, where's your snow pants? Upstairs. Oh, uh, where's your boots? Upstairs. Um, you're not bringing that cardigan? I am bringing that. Oh. <laughs> okay, it's this plus my snow pants. Your toiletries, where are those at? They're not in that bag. They're right there. They're gonna fit in that bag. Uh, are you pumped? Feeling like that, that day before vacation giddy. Hey, Aiden, turn it up. Morning. I was having dreams about hill climb. We're leaving here in a couple minutes. We're gonna go to Minneapolis, almost four hours away. We're watching the World Cup Nordic ski races for the next two days. Let's go. Belle wants to show you her, her snow pants. Got to the parking garage. I'm not sure that we know what we're doing yet. We didn't get a parking spot in time. So, so we we're in a parking garage, we have to take a bus, and then we're gonna go watch them ski. We have 11 stops on this bus. We're doing it in 19 minutes. No shot. From the Club Nordic Mont Saint Anne, Felix Olivier Moreau. So Kevin Bolger of Monaco, Wisconsin, still on the bubble in 30th spot. Canadian Austin is pimping in his outfit. It's the same outfit I wear every day. <laughs> Just uh, got back to the hotel a little bit ago. Welcome to my crib. What's up? <laughs> nice. Everything nice and organized. Yeah. This is the foyer. The foyer, it's gorgeous. Coats, shoes, all the essentials. Awesome. Okay, and I'm gonna bring you this way. Mm. A double queen bed. Wow. <laughs> How are we going? We're gonna. This is the best part of your, the whole place. To the pool. To the pool. With Anna's swimsuit, because I Old forgot Navy. mine. Old Navy. Old Navy. Friends. Link in the right here. box. It is four o'clock. We're gonna go down to the pool, and then we're gonna go to Austin's favorite restaurant. Cheesecake. Cheesecake Factory. What was your thoughts on the day, on the skiing today? Those were some pretty dope races. I can't take you seriously when you say dope. Okay. I thought it was awesome. Didn't you think it was awesome? Yeah, I did. Did you think it was awesome? 
Yes, 1010 experience. Saw Jesse Dickens in person. Yes. Through Minnesota? Yeah. 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 It's awesome. It was from, really cool. From the home state. Yeah. Well, surprising. <laughs> we actually learned a lot today, regardless of how much we yeah, knew or didn't we know. We didn't learned really, a lot. It was yeah. crazy. We didn't really know what we were doing. No, but... World Cup was nuts, so. Yeah. Stay tuned. More coming tomorrow. We out. We're finally going down to the pool. <laughs> um, That's Belle, what she's wearing down to the pool. This is Pimp. <laughs> she, she gets weirder and weirder each day. Pimp? She was saying dope earlier. <laughs> Would it bother anybody if I worked on my cannonballs? Would it bother anyone if I worked on my cannonballs? <laughs> Fit check for dinner at Cheesecake Factory. We gotta go comfy. I'm trying to get a lot in this tummy. <laughs> That's what you're wearing. Yeah, it's a place for <laughs> families and Camrys. You ever heard the Drake talk about that? Or maybe it's not Drake. Anyways. The kids could go to Disney. That one? Yeah, that's all. <laughs> Why you gotta fight with me at Cheesecake? You know I love to go there. This a place for families that drive Camrys and go to Disney. We're waiting for Cheesecake. So we're shopping around. I know, Dick's Sporting Goods right next to it. I just had to take a Deadly little peek. combo. <laughs> Dead. Are you gonna do it or what? I don't know, is it free? Probably not. Look at all those Stanleys. <laughs> <laughs> Look at all those chickens. Back from Cheesecake Factory. <laughs> Austin putting in some work. We uh, I can't even think. That's how full <laughs> we are. I was talking about the bread previously, the rye bread, and got to ya. That's all I ate. We have leftovers, and we still got cheesecake. Look at that. We're still gonna have some of that tonight, though. Yeah, oh it's my only. Gosh, it looks so good. It's only 8:30, and. I'd say in an hour we're gonna eat again. <laughs> we will not be probably. <laughs> Austin, on the other hand, he'll get his second wind. Let me see that. I'll pop it open. <laughs> Careful now. Oh. Oh my gosh, let's get a nice close up of that. Check it out, a little Snickers cheesecake. We'll get a little perfect ratio of oh my whipped gosh. cream on there. Yeah. Fiverr. Oh my gosh. Is that an AI company? No. Oh my gosh, this is bussin'. Bussin', bussin'. We should eat it all and then go to the room next door and eat all my parents, huh? <laughs> Just kidding. That one's pretty good too. R E S C P G C. I think that was wrong. Yeah, if I was, but sound right, didn't it? I just woke up. I'm gonna go to the gym and get a quick workout in before we head to the races today.
second day. We just watched the boys go and now it's gonna be the girls distance race. We found Techno Corner. So you can see the racers have to go up this huge hill. So they're pumping them up in Techno Corner. Honestly, before I met Austin, I had no idea that cross country skiing could be this hype. Like, it's pretty hype. It is a lot of fun. <laughs> and there's a lot of people that enjoy it. Yeah. Sitting outside in the freezing cold for hours on end watching people race. It's pretty yeah. fun. <laughs> We're going into um, the last race of the weekend. It's a girls 10K race. Uh, most, of the, most of the people here are um, cheering on Jessie Diggins. She's a Minnesota native. Um, she got fourth in the sprints yesterday. We weren't sure if she was racing today, uh, but I believe she's bid 56, so she'll be at the end of the race. So. Um, we'll show you a few clips of that. They're gonna be, they get loud for her. Yeah. And she's pretty hype herself, actually, so. And your bib number doesn't indicate your place. So we'll have to watch the live um, results. Because okay, it's hard okay. to tell where they're at, but. Get high! Also, Jessie yeah. Dickens is an Olympic gold medalist. Gold, she's got, wait, gold, right? She's got a gold, she's got a silver, and a bronze. So she's good. These people. We're thinking. They got the whole hot dog set up. I need yeah. a hot dog. I know. <laughs> Let's just say that hotel breakfast this morning did not do us any favors. <laughs> not it. <laughs> Jesse Diggins is about to come up this hill. She's just warming up. Yeah, we got a three hour drive after this. But we learned a lot about the camera too this weekend. Yeah, we did. So from, from what we've heard, she's in four. She's got about 15 to 20 seconds to make up to get in that first spot. That's what we've heard. She's on her last lap. 